Shalom. I'd like to say all praises due unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahweshai, Ba'ashem Rekakodash. Double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and bless the open number of the elect. Uh, this is just a quick lesson. Um, you know, based on the movie uh, Avatar 2, I have to watch it. You know, uh, it's like three hours almost. I have to really watch it. But uh, it's based upon our. I watched the first one, you know, years ago. You know, in uh, the early 2000s. You know, I think 2004, 2005. But uh, I got to watch uh, two again uh, because it's based on our people, man. You know, the 10 tribes. You know, uh, also, if you watch that movie with Mel Gibson, uh, you know, Apocalypto. No, no, that, that's a very good uh, film to watch as well. If you haven't saw it, watched it, you know, and uh, you know, they painted them as blue, you know, and basically uh, blue, you know, um, I believe in German, you know, basically means black or dark, right? So, um, you know, so Esau, he, he, he does this stuff, you know. He gives people certain clues, you know, as to who we are, you know, you know, they call, you know, Esau's, uh, even though he's a devil, you know, he's telling, he's showing us a lot of clues as to who we are, you know, and, uh, you know, you read about, um, you know, the, the monks, you know, of Japan, or, uh, the monks and of China and, uh, the samurais, you know, you know, uh, like to be a, a black, like to be person, like to be a, a samurai, you know, like you had to be like a, a black man, you know, and uh, it's in uh, the, it's in the records. All right, I'm gonna just put it. be a samurai and I'm gonna put black man uh. all right this is uh September 7th 2024 this is just flowing in the spirit. Um, didn't really have nothing planned. Um, flowing in the spirit, you know, with the, you know, like with the Rakako Dash, the Holy Spirit that's gonna guide us, guide me. You know, also, uh, you know, there's a book called uh, Afro Presence in uh, Asia, you know, by Ivan Sterneman and by this man, Renako. On that Renako. Uh, on that Rashidi, you know, this is a very uh, good read, you know, that book, you know, I'm sure, sure that there's PDFs, you know, or you could buy it, um, you know, it says, uh, Slovakia, damn, uh, ads, it says, the black presence in early Japan, Although the island, island nation of Japan uh, occupies the extreme eastern ex, uh, extension of Asia, is, it is assumed by many to uh, have been historically the composed of uh, essential homogeneous you know, population and culture. And just find that whole uh, saying, you know, to be a samurai, you know, you have to be, uh, you know, like you have to be a, a black man, you know, like to be an official samurai, you know, and this was our, our people, you know. One second, I gotta get, um, I have to get my glasses, lock here.
get my reading glasses. Lucky, okay, one second. You know we are, uh, you know we're in a low state. You know, but these nations, they know who we are, man. The whole world knows who you are, black man. All right, all right. Or uh, Judah, you know. You know we're the house of, La you know we're we're from the stock of Jacob, man. You know and uh, you know and uh, we come out of the waters of Jacob. We come out of the waters of Adam, man. We come out of the, the waters of the Messiah. How we shy? All right. The Lion of Judah, man. You know. And this was a samurai, uh, a samurai, uh, you know, warrior, man. Says uh, when a six foot tall African, right? Which he's not African, he's an Israelite. All right. Slave landed in Japan. He uh, stuck out like a sore thumb. People... Uh, you could read it, you know, um, you know, you know, we're a spectacle, man. The nation know who we are, you know, you see, like, that's why, um, you know, a lot of our, you know, the, the whole, like, passport bros, you know, the, you know, Israelites who's going to, uh, you know, the different parts of the world, you know, to live or to travel, you know, they're, uh, you know, they're, you know they're uh you know they're popping a lot of these women man and you know having seeds and doing what they gotta do man all right and you know and and that's why the so-called you know like black women's pissed off all right because they want us to be under the, their foot you know you know because uh you know because nobody wants to deal with no uh fake you know stinky hair you know you know, and basically, uh, you know, where our people are going back to their regal mentality, man. You know what I mean? And uh, but I I remember also going to uh, the the ROM, the Royal Ontario Museum of Ontario. You know, and I uh, went into like the Asian section. You know, with the China. You know, uh, the Han Dynasty, um, the Shang Dynasty um you know and and they were black they're the, the han dynasty the shang um i believe uh the wu dynasty you know and the tang you know we had dynasties man you know king david man he had many wars you know against the ammonites and moab you know and uh you know you know, King David was a warrior king, man. You know, who defeated many nations. I'm gonna get this one second. Yeah, I'm just flowing in the spirit. Then I'm gonna get a couple of scriptures. It says King David in uh this I got this from the brother Jeremiah. King David in 1970 BC gave Solomon one million talents of silver. That means somewhere between about a hundred million pounds of silver or 500 tons of silver. Um, that amazing amount silver would be uh, worth 30 to 50 billion. Is an SUV. Um, at that, um, at that, Slaka. says that that's amazing of uh silver that amount of that amazing amount of silver would be uh, worth worth 30 to 50 billion dollars today at um uh, at res recent market close about about 32 dollars on the stock of about like about 32 dollars an ounce right and you know and um you know you know king david he had a, a lot of he had a, a lot of wealth man you know he he defeated you know many nations man you know within that region you know and um you know 
his son Solomon, you know, you know Solomon was he was glorious, man. All right, the wisest king, you know. David also gave Solomon a hundred thousand talents of gold. That is about ten million pounds of gold or five hundred tons of gold. That amazing amount. That amazing amount of gold would be worth about. 276 billion dollars today uh so in like today's uh times it'd be 172 dollars 172 172 hundred stock yeah 1725 dollars an ounce right uh david had a uh, vast treasure you know so uh you know you could read about you could uh you know screenshot this you know because uh you know we're gonna get back that and and everything man a hundredfold and i'm gonna get that scripture i believe in um in job said that ye are gods but you shall die like men all right because uh we are gods the the black man all right the 10 tri or the 12 tribes of israel you know we're uh we're at gods man all right but we, we died i have said i have said we are gods Um, Psalms 82 verse 6 I have said ye are gods And all of you are the children of the most high Alright So where's the children of God The sons of God Alright The sons of Jacob You know the 12 patriarchs the, You know the 12 princes The 12 kings Alright Ye are but you shall die like men and fall like one of the princes. So where we you know, you, even though we were so uh, wealthy, we were so great, you know, we're, uh, you know, we're men of renown, you know. We read about the sons of God, about Nephilim. All right, cause Jake, man, Jake's over there, you know, in uh, Brazil, you know, South uh, South America. Asia, you know, we're uh, we're spreading our seed, man. It's lucky. It's damn at it's lucky. I'm just getting in the spirit. Cause we're we're gonna get it. Um, about uh, this. One second. You know, cause you know, like you know, prior to the flood, man. You know, like they're the mighty men. You know, the sons of God. And you know, they we we thought that the the daughters of men that the, that their uh, wives were or their 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 daughters were very uh, fair. Slug. I'm gonna find it. One second. You know, Adam, you know, Adam, you know, when he was in his, uh, you know, you know, like before Eve, you know, like she, uh, you know, she was beguiled by the serpent, you know, you know, Adam, he followed Eve and we uh, fell. But uh, after that, you know, uh, let's go to get it. It's lucky. This is Satan. I'm just trying to find the scripture. I don't get it, Slack yeah. Sometimes uh the damn devil man, Slack yeah. one second. Nephilim Nef okay.
One second, man. It's fucking devil, man. One second, one second. Because the Nephilim, they weren't men who slept with a, uh, angels or 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 the or, or, or Saka. damn angels who slept with a woman or no we were in a very uh, high estate the wickedness of mankind yes i gotta highlight that man slack yeah i got my uh got my bible you know the actual uh you know king james you know I'm gonna highlight that you know because you know prior to the flood you know like this is like basically like we're living basically um you know like the that we're like like we're, like we're basically like living you know like how they were like how our people were living you know like prior to the flood and uh, the same shit, same things happening again, man. And we're gonna get a couple scriptures, man. All right, we're doing our uh, people are doing all kinds of stuff, uh, you know, alphabet lifestyle, orgies, you know, marriage, you know, drinking and wine and stuff. It says um, Genesis six and one. It said the corruption of mankind. All right, isn't this a corrupt society that we live in? now and it shall come to pass when it says when man slack and it shall come to pass when men began to multiply on the face of the earth and the daughters of and the and the daughters were born unto them that the sons of the yahweh all right or the power saw the daughters of men that they were very fair all right so they're very beautiful I had long hair look at this man see our woman now man you know it's talking not now you know back then you know because the black women don't have here no hair like you know like how they had back then man all right all right we got to go back to the basics man so i come to pass when when man began to multiply on the face of the earth, the daughters of, the, and daughters were born unto them, that the sons of Yahweh saw the daughters of men that they were very fair, and they and they took them wives all which they chose. Right. So you had the sons of the of God. All right. And then you had the sons of the uh, the men. And then you had the sons of of Cain. All right. The sons of the wicked men. All right, so we had all kind of different, you know, we had all kind of women, right? Because we were, you know, we were the sons of God, right? But basically, you know, we, we corrupted it, you know, by, you know, you know, by worshiping, you know, idols. And that's what the same thing was going on right now. Not pretty much the same thing. Um, and the Lord said, my my spirit shall not always strive with man for he is also in the flesh right and we are in this flesh right now you know we see what's going on right now what goes on you know we're the ones who's trying to you know like keep it holy you know we're trying to keep it you know we're trying to keep the spirit you know like to best our ability we're trying to keep the laws you know to best our ability you know uh you know because right now you know like our you know like our, our like our people right now are doing all kinds of things man you know uh threesomes you know they're doing all kinds of shit you know child you know whole that pedo type rings and all kinds of shit man you know this whole world you know is based off of witchcraft and sorcery man so we you know we're calling we're crying on to yahweh the father to save us from this hell that we're in man because you know we're not supposed to be living like this man under uh you know uh, under the serpent man which has been uh, esau you know 
Kane, you know, who's back in his stead and he's wreaking havoc on the earth. All right, so we need Yahweh Shai to come. That it said there were giants in the earth in those in those days and all and also and also after that the sons of god came in unto them right so we're we're um, at a you know a high estate you know you know they were actually uh, you know like they were very giant they were very tall all right you know like look at men like Shaq. you know like you know like shaquille o'neal you know you know you know even imagine back then man you know we're fucking probably you know 15 feet you know you know like we're probably i'm um, like 15 feet tall you know even taller you know you know like back in the um in that time man all right because i i, I have some pictures where uh, there's giants i'm gonna put it let's get it Let's get it. This is off of um off of Pinterest drying giant. Yeah. Right? So you know like you know like this is a guy look like Lao Ming. You know, or what's the name of the basketball player from the Chinese man? You know, but imagine us, Jacobites, man. You know, cause everyone was tall. You know. I'm gonna put giant black man. Put 1900s. All right, but, uh, you can see these guys. You can see the whole like basketball players right now, man. All right. One second. This is the, you know, the whole, uh, uh, like Andre the Giant, you know, I believe he's, uh, he's Irish or, uh, or Scott, you know, had that power, man. And he's, uh, you see, he has woolly hair, you know, what the, download that, yeah, man. We're, we're gonna go right back to that state, man, but we're gonna be royal. You know, we're going to be a nation of kings and priests. You know, we're going to have, uh, you know, have, like, proper daughters, proper wives. You know, Sarah means noble woman. All right. So we're going to have noble woman. We're not going to have queen. We look at queen, Q-U-E-A-N. It means uh, uh, like a woman of low rank. All right. We want a woman of high rank who's going to reverence us, man. The giant. It said there were giants in the earth in those days and also after that when the sons of Yahweh came in unto the daughters of men all right because you know we you know we're populated man all right you know we're probably you know you, when you get a cold you, you know that cold. our you know like you know that our loins was very uh long long strong all right <laughs> you know bamboo it said there were giants in the earth in those days. Also, after that, when the sons of Yahweh came in unto the daughters of men, they bare children to them. The same that began to, that to be mighty men, which were men of renown. You know, we see what's going on right now. I think uh, basketball player, uh, you know, there are a lot of, you know, our uh, you know our people you know we that we be sleeping with you know let's say you might have a, a um, Asian woman you know 
uh, Jap or uh, no Filipino, Japanese type woman or whatever. And then, uh, you know, your son or your daughter grows up or whatever, you know, but they look like, uh, you know, but they look like, uh, like a damn Japanese, right? Or, or uh, you know, or like Filipino, right? You know, because we, anywhere where we dwelling uh, and we're sleeping with these different nations, you know, our people, uh, you know, like that's why we have, you know, that like many different features, right? Because, you know, your like your lineage it goes to your father's seed, right? It goes through your father's nutsack, his, you know, do his the roots, all right? And we are the ones, we're the husband who plants, all right? Who plant the field, who dig in, you know, and plant the seed deep, all right? And you know, and so that life grows, right? And you know the, the and the woman is the body you know who's gonna nourish who's gonna nourish it you know and to maintain it. Right. They said there were giants in the earth in those days, and also after that, they, when the sons of Yahweh came in unto the, the daughters of men, they bear children to them. The same began to be mighty men, which were men of old and of renown. All right. You see what's going on right now with the whole uh, NFL players, you know, basketball players. You know, these are like, um, you watch uh, movies like Spartacus, you know, that series, you know. You know, that was us, you know, during the Roman Empire, man. All right, and basically, uh, it's a bread and circus right now, you know, and basically, uh, you know, our people, our, our, our men, you know we're uh, we're out here. You know we're populating and we're planting seed. Right? But uh, unfortunately, the Lord he's only he's only dealing with a righteous seed, right? With his elect, right? The one third, All right? Kalamosa is gonna do a, a clean up, man. Yahweh and the powers saw the wickedness of men. Stuck and the powers saw. That wickedness of man was created, stuck up, and the power saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. You don't see these guys, you know, these like you know, like like these guys want to be women, you know, these guys that have big beards to talk about they're pregnant whole bunch of confusion man that's why the lord's gonna come back again all right and it's not gonna be with water now it's gonna be think with fire shall come and uh it repented the lord that he had made man on the earth and it grieved him at his heart and the lord saw i will i will destroy man whom I uh, created from the face of the earth both man and beast and every creeping thing and the fowls of the air for it repent of me that I have made them right and that's what goes on the, the Lord was so vexed you know that he only he, he, he like he only had Noah you know his sons and their wives you know so the only like there's only eight souls you know who was uh, saved man all right and everything was you know you know basically uh all everything you know was destroyed right you only had uh you know who basically uh when you read about you know if you read uh, if you read uh, if you read like genesis 6 and 7 it goes into that and noah found grace in the eyes of the lord and that's what we're hoping you know that lord has has grace you know on his elect all right because right now we're still in the grace period right now all right let's look at uh grace then i'm gonna get off uh, think second peters grace chan or khan khan it says uh it's not good pass favor uh, grace, charm, favor, Chennai, 
like it said to be gracious show favor pity so the lord's gonna have pity on his elect man all right because uh it's gonna get so bad you know we're gonna get you know jacob's trouble is gonna be uh, it's approaching man and uh all hell's gonna break loose you know you know like 2023 you know 2024 man anything could happen right now This is not the one. Stuck it. Uh, Second Peter's two, verse uh, four. For Yahweh spared not the angels that sin. All right. So where are the angels? We fell, you know, from that, you know, from that spirit, man. All right. From the sons of God. All right. Because we, you know, we fell. And Noah, you know, the Lord, the Most High was only dealing with Noah, man, and then his sons. All right, and um, basically, uh, you know, the earth was repopulated, you know, and we branched off, you know, and basically, um, the Lord was only dealing with a, 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 a royal line through Shem, all right, going all the way down through our frac side, Eber, Peleg, you know, the Torah, and then Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. We come out that royal line, all right, so. You know, you are so like all you nations who want to worship, like like all you nations who want to look down on, you know, so-called black man. You guys come out of our nutsack, you know. For it, Yahweh spare not the angels that sin, but cast them down to hell and delivered them in chains of darkness to be reserved unto judgment. All right, and we're in this change of darkness right now, man. All right, and uh, you know, you no, know, like that's why the most size, you know, like we're always saying our, our fathers in Hebrew, all right, our father who are in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as in heaven, man. And that's what we're hoping to get because this hell or this hell that we're or this place that we're in is hell right now, man. And deliver them into darkness to be reserved unto judgment. And spare not the ain spare not the old world, but save Noah the eighth person. So if you know, you look at that uh, that if you know into the Hebrew, it means infinity, right? And I believe uh, if I think in India, you know, uh, you can look into that number if you know, because uh, the most I deals with numbers, man. But it saved Noah, the eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly, right? And we see what's going on right now, you know, with the whole bunch of, uh, you know, child child trafficking, you know, um, a whole bunch of different witch havens, you know, a whole bunch of things, what they do, you know, orgies, whole bunch of shit you know with this whole uh greco way of life this whole babylonian you know and um you know the this damn egyptian you know like a like egyptian mystery school man you know that these people practice man bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly and turn the city of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemn them with the overthrow, making them an example unto those that should live ungodly and deliver just Lot, vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. So even Lot, Lot, you know, because uh, Abraham, he had uh, a nephew, Lot, right? And basically, uh, you know after like after that like after that destruction you know basically uh it was so great that after that destruction you know basically uh lot and his 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 wife his wife looked behind his wife looked behind you know but basically uh you know to the most high he he sent an angel to to blood clot um to zap her you know and, and she became a pillar of salt all right and basically um 
we're gonna get that story about Moab. We're gonna get that story about Moab and um and Ammon, Slakia. Moab and Ammon, yeah. So lucky I'm just flowing in the spirit, so just bear with me. One second. Less loss, lot deep. So uh, yeah, so uh, this is after the flood, right? That um, basically, Lot's daughters thought that basically, you know that you know that the whole earth was destroyed, you know, and basically they thought that you know that the only way to let like, to preserve seed, you know, is to sleep with their father, all right? And they drunk him, they made him drunk. All right, and basically, that's how they were able like, to produce seed, and they were called in the Mongoloids now. All right, and that's why the so called Japanese, you Koreans, you know, um, you Chinese, you guys come out of that seed, all right, of Lot to Abraham, you know, and Lot, he was in that righteous. He's, you know, lots, you know, he's an Israelite. <laughs> so, this is the Lord's movie, man. And um, Genesis 19 and 30. And Lot went up, up of Zoar and dwelt in the mountain, and his two daughters with him. And uh, for he feared to dwell in Zoar. And he dwelt in the cave, he and his two daughters. All right, because it was that you know, because that destruction was so great. All right, so let's read. And the firstborn said unto the her, unto the younger, O father is old, and there is not a man in the earth to come in unto us after, after the manner of all the earth. Come, let us make our father drink wine and we will lie with them that we we may preserve seed or sperm or seed or sperma or raza on speed or that we that we may preserve seed of our father and he and they made their father drink wine that night and the firstborn went in and lay with her father and he perceived not when he lay down nor when he arose so that's why they drunk in the man all right you could read that you know basically uh you know that's how you you know so-called Ammon and moab you come out of that that lot so you japanese you know and uh jake's over there man and basically you know we're already there you know for many moons you know you know we're the gods man all right and uh the elect all right the one third are gonna go back to their royal regal estate man all right and um this is just a video what that's kind of this what influenced me Slakia, you know, uh, this is a good video. GMS, uh, one second, very good pitch, a good video. Welcome to One Chosen, where we got scripture uh, foundation. You know, this is not a guy, topic. He's not a guy, he's like in the truth, but he seemed like he's like a historian, he's a, he's a big reader. All right, because um, there's a lot of knowledge that they don't want us to know, man. All right, and they say uh, they say that the best way to hide something from a nigga is to like is to put it in a book. 
All right. So um, with that, that is all praises due unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, the one to the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and bless the whole for members of the elect. Um, I'm going to share this link. Also, um, I'm going to share this link too of this article. All right. Um, this is a uh, 2.8 billion settlement reacted in the class action lawsuit over residential schools and we see what they did to residential schools all right you had the slave coast or the uh the slave river you know in alberta and uh you know um you know and basically uh basically uh there's a lot of uh you know her heart her uh, heart uh her harm you know that uh came on the tribes all right and then you have these edomites you know who's who come as chiefs all right and they and they're making billions of dollars trying to say that they're uh that they're indian you know but you're really a a, a five dollar indian man you're a, you're a front all right and they're making a lot of money revenue you know by classing themselves uh indian you know because you still have our people who is still autonomous and stuff. So with that, Shalom.